Hello and welcome to episode four. Uh, in this episode, uh, I think you're gonna you're gonna agree with me uh, on the choice that I made. Um, and as I said, um, each group that I that I choose, or each uh, uh, person, or whatever that I choose, uh, I do it uh, because they meet my own requirements of what I think is uh, a very good team and uh, a very good people. Uh, that are real, that have, um, are proud of their evidence, that show show good evidence, and um, of course they have integrity. Um, this uh, this group, just like the rest, have integrity and stuff. And uh, so I really I really hope you enjoy this. Uh, um, and remember uh, to to roll this person's bones if you haven't already done so. All right. Uh, thank you very much for for being here, and I hope you enjoy episode number four. Thank you. Hey. <laughs> Did it say hey, man? Yeah, hey. Luna is EVPs on location and gets pretty good results. Gary's something. Whoa! Gary's here. Gary's here. Oh, What's up, Gary? Thank you for everything, brother. Not only does this show respect to the it also shows respects to the veterans. I like this. Yeah, another another World War II veteran right here. See, I like talking to veterans. Um, go out to one of your local cemeteries and find a gravestone that looks like it hasn't been taken care of, and and just do a little something special for it. I know I'm taking up the challenge. Stop and look. Hyman Sher what is that? Hyman Sherman? I'm sorry, Hyman. I just want to clean you up here a little bit. Uh, uh, sorry guys, hold on a second. Thank you for your service, Hyman. I think that shows why I have love and respect for this young man. I think all your questions are answered. Hey guys. I'd like to thank all the veterans for their service. Oh my gosh, Judas. You're gonna have to do that. Thank you so much, but you didn't have to do that. Hey, can you pick up that stone right there? Put it back up there. It was right here. Oh yeah. See? Yeah. Is that you, bro? You're facing that way? I, I do. I wasn't even moving. I was standing still. Dude, I just seen something behind you while you were shooting that way. There's Daryl right there. Well, shit, if that won't mess you up and play with your mind. Dude, it just looked like somebody was standing on that grave. But guys, if you look inside here, there's actually caskets made out of concrete or, or granite. It's colder in there. It is colder in there. Dude, put your hand in there. Dude, it is. It is colder in there. Now this would be Barney's. We keep hearing voices behind us. Is it a big B? No, Sorry guys, if you can't see oh, yeah, too says, well, I'm trying to show you. Lorette H. Barney, 18, 1985. Right. Sudden changes in temperature often means spiritual activity. Oh, okay, okay, I admit, this cracked me up a little bit, you know. Uh, well, mainly because I spent my entire life in the bush. Um, so anyway, I thought this was kind of cute. 
This is crazy. I want out. Can you see? You want to get up here next to me? Guys, if you look around how thick this is, we're in the woods. There is no more being in the woods than we are right now. Oh, oh shadows are creeping me out. I think we're out. Dude, son, just grab my arm. I'm not joking. Dude. Oh, come on. What are, what are we coming to here? A dead end? Are you? Whoa. Am I freaking myself out here, dude? Yeah, we're good. Here we go. Yeah, we got people. Yo, did you hear that? Yo, I just heard a voice, dude. Guys, we are in an insane asylum in this little tiny rinky-dink town, uh, Belchertown, Massachusetts. Oh, wow, guys. Holy crap. Wow, are you kidding me? Are you cereal here? Dude, this is the meaning of awesome location. Oh, it stinks in here. It is of the utmost importance, and I cannot stress this enough, to keep the rest of your team informed with anything that's going on, anything that you might feel, see, hear, because if you're not forewarned, things can happen in a heartbeat. So keep people informed. I keep seeing weird stuff out of corner of my eyes. Guys. Wow. Wow, guys. All right, we got bathrooms here. We got pentagram here. Wow, guys. Wow, I'm getting a warm feeling in my hands right here, dude. Right here. Dude, do you feel something warm right in this area? I feel something warm. That was kind of, kind of weird. Yeah. Let's stick together. Uh, maybe. Don't you think? Hey. Let's stick together. Come on. Yes, in any new location, stick together. Don't be silly. Um, make sure you know where you are before you split up. We should be able to remember our way out of here. Yo. There's our way out of here. What does it say on the door? Who is super gay? Somebody is super gay. Well, look at the ceiling. See how the ceiling's all coming Yeah, down? okay. This is like a, a, a playing Resident Evil dude. No, like, this is like real life. Resident Evil, E equals MC square. Let's check this room. Dude, oh my gosh, nah, no, no, man, I just heard something from over there. Yo, I swear I just heard, like, like, it, it sounded like if a nurse were to say something over the intercom. Dude, let's stick together, stop doing that to me. It's lagging. Hey, is it lagging, guys? He's back? It said he's back. Yeah, I've never been here. We were just here and we just got back. Oh yeah, we're back. You're right, we walked to the truck. You're right, we're back. I heard it too. Wow, I didn't get that. Which one? A movie. A movie. You heard that? It said a movie. Yeah, kind of. we're kind of making like a movie. We're recording with a camera. So if you guys want to be in the movie, all you have to do is walk in front of my friend Daryl here. You want me to stop? Dude, are you smoking still? Yeah. Hello. This is an amazing building. Thank you for letting us uh, film here. 
I'm sure if you didn't want us to. Oh, this place is creepy. Huh? This place is so creepy. It is creepy. Whoa. Oh, I thought I'd just seen something. Louis seeing things now. I thought I'd seen the door closed, but there's no door. <laughs> he thought he saw the door closed, but there's no door there. Look at these ones. Oh, wow, this one is awesome. Look at this. The two swords. Oh, this is so cool. These are cool. So these got to be like a bunch of different no, military memorial type graves. Oh boy, new toys. I like toys. Can I have a toy? Hey, how do you get that? I want a toy. Cool beans. I like this uh, connect. I'm just starting to learn how to use it. But uh, definitely a cool, cool tool. I like it and I'm making a video as well so you guys will be able to see everything that I record with the connect we're looking at right now with the connect and it's just reaching out to trace them it's yeah <laughs> this is ridiculous Try that thing. Sacred to the memory, Sacred to the memory of Captain Edwards C. No, it's White, who died August 1821st. God bless you, sir, and thank you for your service. Unexplained sense can be spiritual activity coming through the veil. There's a smell of roses. Do you guys smell roses? That's what I smell. Do you smell roses? Yes. Yep. Really heavy. What? That's so I just weird. got a strong smell of roses and so did they. That's amazing. Get over here. Cause there was I was just looking at something behind that tree. And then you told me you heard something. But it came from that way. I don't give a shit. There was something behind this tree. When I just looked at it, and then I turn around and it's gone. Let's go. Your mom's way over there. That was crazy. I look at the tree, there's something. It just looks like there's a little something on the side of the tree. That tree right there. I'm gonna go around it. I saw something people from behind one of the graves earlier. Look at that grave glowing over there. You know what? Let's just walk back this way. I'm good. I'm good with things being there one second and then being gone the next. This is why I always say stay close by because things can happen in a heartbeat. You never know. I definitely don't think it was a person because it was gone so instantly. Holy crap, guys. Well... I am so happy to be able to, to do a cool live stream. Wow, look at this phone, old school phone. Crap, little brother, you just aged me, man. Really? 
old school phone? Come on. Really? Shit. Alright, let's scare the crap out of somebody. Right away. Hello? Hello. What? Where am I standing? What was this place used for? Wow. Who am I talking to? Oh man, that's crazy. My phone just flew out of the, the, the holder. There's no reason it should. Thing is, I come here out of full respect. I mean, I am here at nighttime, yes, but I'm not here to provoke or be disrespectful in any way. Oh, don't tell me she disappeared on me. She had to go back. You kidding me? She don't leave me out here by myself. Oh well. Once again, uh, Lou shows that he has a heart of gold. Um, this is one of the reasons that uh, I respect this guy and uh, I always have his back, you know. Chester Smith who died the 23rd of June in the 34th year of his age. Sorry for my reading, guys. Also of his infant daughter, R. Francis, who died the 25th of July. Oh, I am so sorry. Age three months. God bless you both. You have a beautiful stone here. It is beautiful. Look at the tree on there, guys. This is a beautiful stone. Yeah. It really lights up with the... Look at the... Uh, you see the little shine? Like, yeah. it's kind of cool. Dude, I heard that. It's something in the woods. You heard it, right? Yeah, Snapping? The trees, yeah. but there's something over there. Yeah, I keep hearing that over there. That's why I saw that white figure, too. That's scary, bro. And we're walking towards it. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, dude. It's all around us. What the heck is that? Do you, yeah, do you hear that? It's like everywhere around us. It's like snap. It, it sounded like first over there, but now all the way around us. Yeah. We were walking over there, and we were hearing so many noises. I'm like, all right, let's go back over on this side. I got my knife in my hand. I am definitely sketched out. Yeah. Let's go over here and do some EVPs. Bro. Dude, you can just keep hearing it. Yeah. And what's crazy is you said that it was Indians who snuck through the woods, right? It was Indians that crept up on them and killed That's what all of them. It sounds like, bro. It sounds like they're creeping up on it. Whoa. Whoa. It's like it's taunting us, dude. I'm going this way. Sorry, man. Yeah. I'm going this way. Just get back. I'll kick you right in your face. 
Like, yo, I got you on camera, dude. You do sign, you're going to jail. I'm letting you know. Back the fuck up. I'm leaving, dude. Back the fuck up. Back the fuck up. I'll kick you right in your fucking face. I'm good. Dude, get the f back. Yeah, it's funny. You think it's funny? You think it's funny? You think I'm fucking with you? Dude, go and get the f***ing car running. If I let him get up the f***ing stairs. You got the car? Get the car running, bro. This is why you never go alone. Shit can happen fast. Yo, get the f*** out of here. Let's go. Quick, get the car. Yo, pull out, pull out, pull out, quick. Lock the doors. Lock the doors. Get the f*** out of here, dude. Get the fuck out of here, quick. He ain't coming out. He ain't coming out. I don't see him. All right, get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Guys, there was just a drug addict in this freaking house. All right, we're getting, we're getting out of here. Dude, that was crazy. I was trying to help the guy, bro. I was trying to fucking help the guy. Dude, what the fuck? Look, 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 look. Yo, roll your window. Pull the fucking window up. Yo, roll, yo, roll your window up. Doors locked? Yeah, get the f out of here, bro. Am get I good? The good? Out of here. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Get the f out of here. Oh my god. What the f is that? You just bottomed out, dude. No, it's good. Let's go. The f guy's coming after us, bro. What the f? Dude, what the f was that, bro? I was just trying to help the freaking guy. Dude, I can't believe that shit. Dude, that's why. He was down to the f That's gun. why. People need to know this shit is not f***ing safe. Yeah. You don't just go into freaking abandoned buildings with no weapons, no nothing, not knowing where the hell you're at. That's why I tell people, do not freaking do this stuff at home. Uh, that was freaking scary, bro. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I thought it was. I thought it was pretty good. I quite enjoyed it. Um, it's really hard. I, I went through 61 hours of footage, um, watched 61 hours worth, and it's really hard to pick out what I want to put up uh, for a 20-minute special. <laughs> it's quite the task, uh, but I think I think I did okay. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and, and I I hope Lou that you enjoy being uh, uh, paranormal sea bass approved. Uh, I love you, kid, and uh, like I say, if you ever need anything, you know you know where I am. It's easy to get a hold of me, brother. All right, so uh, everybody, if you haven't got uh, Lou's uh, uh, channel there, make sure you roll his bones, all right, because he's, he's, a, he's a good kid. He's a good kid. All right, talk to you all later.